You have already learned about sentence structure, the subject, object, verb order in lesson 1, part 1. So you learn watashi wa ringo wo tabemashita. Okay, it used to be tabemas. I just changed it to tabemashita, which means at ate, the past tense. So now we are want to try to challenge something. You can see this means I add apples. But how about we change it to I add two apples yesterday. So we have to add two. We have to add yesterday. So how do we go about adding two apples? Do we say uh, two ringo or tabemashita? And for yesterday, do we put it at the back like English? Okay, so over here is a very important sentence structure. For two apples, right, we usually add the number in front of the verb. So two will be futatsu. Sorry. Futatsu. Tsu is actually a counter for something that is very small like apples so a lot of things can be used with zi in chinese it's like ge, zhe ge, na ge. okay it's very widely used yesterday yesterday is kino okay we will add kino after watashi wa So you learn something new today. For things like time and date, you put it in front. For example, uh, you can put today, yesterday, the day before, three days ago. You can put tomorrow, two days later. You can put uh, this week, this month, this year. You can even put right now. Right now is Ima, etc. So uh, there's something that you need to take note. Only when there are numbers, you actually need to put a particle. So remember, there is actually a time particle called ni. Okay, this is actually used when it's very specific. For example, uh, ichigatsu, that means January. You add a ni. So, watashi wa ichigatsu ni ringo wo futatsu tabemashita. Okay, doesn't sound very impressive. Like, who, who wants to know when when you add two apples in January? Or you can say, um, kuji. Kuji means 9 p.m. Or, I mean, or 9 a.m. Okay, it can be 9 a.m. or 9 p.m. Okay, you plus a ni. So, these are numbers. These are very specific. Only in these cases, then you have a kuji ni, ichigatsu ni. If not, usually for any others like this month, that month, last week, now, etc. Right? You are, you you would wouldn't need the ni particle. So this is just for extra information. In fact, you will learn this later on in other lessons. So I think what you need to take note of is. For time and date, you should actually put put it in this area after watashi wa. For the number of apples, you actually put it before the verb futatsu.